Oh hey, Susan Hyatt here. No offense to winter, but it is time to thaw out people. Spring is here and I'm betting that your life needs a good cleaning. And I'm not talking about dusting the knickknacks. I'm talking about unfollowing or muting toxic people who you know are not good for you or flushing those stale excuses and finally making some forward movement on your goals or freshening up your self-care routine or washing something or someone out of your life. Someone who is sucking up all the energy in the room. Oh, hey, I'm Susan Hyatt and this is Go Time TV. This is the show about creating what you crave right now. Whatever it is, we're gonna create it right here on Go Time TV. I love a good spring cleaning. It's the perfect time to clear the mess at home and clear whatever mess is happening in your life. So one way I do this is with a digital detox. This concept is not new and often includes a sweeping dramatic declaration of I'm on hiatus only to return right back to the scroll a few days later. What I found is that committing to going off the grid for just one day per week is a great way to ring out my social media time and feel refreshed when I'm back online. Another way I spring clean my life is by scrubbing my damn habits, like taking a good sponge and scouring those hard to clean corners, which I don't do. <laughs> I look at all the things in my life I do out of habit and ask myself if I'm actually enjoying it. For example, hanging out with a group of neighbors because you love one of them, but you don't actually enjoy spending time with the other people, but do it out of habit and social pressure. Along with habits, I often end up sweeping away toxic relationships during my spring clean. For you, relationships might be romantic, platonic, professional, cordial, anyone you come in contact with on a regular basis. Along with habits, I often end up sweeping away toxic relationships during my spring clean. For you, relationships might be romantic, platonic, professional, cordial, anyone you come in contact with on a regular basis. So if your employee causes you to have a daily migraine, it's time to hire someone new. If your barista serves up your latte with a grunt and a frown, hit up the other coffee shop on the next block. I also suggest scrubbing your schedule. Hustle culture is real and real toxic. Constantly working and grinding through spring will only lead to a summer of fizzle and not sizzle. So take a good, hard, honest look at your schedule and determine what you can scrub or outsource to give yourself more freedom and sanity. What about you? How are you going to clean up your act this spring? I'd love to know in the comments below. If you are ready to refresh your life and enjoy this episode, please tap that thumbs up button below and hit subscribe to get notified when we release new episodes. And if you think this video can help someone in your life who needs a serious spring clean, hit that share button. It's people like you and my favorite caffeinated tea that keeps this show going. Until next time, it's go time.